everybody this is my January favorites I'm going to split those into four four categories uh, the first one is book the second one is music the third one will be movie and the last one will be whatever else happened in the in the month so let's get started the first one book sometimes a great notion by Ken Kesey 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 I don't know how you pronounce that name Anyway, I have it in French, so we have et quelques fois j'ai comme une grande idée. First, the story itself is not that fascinating to be on. Well, I find it incredible. Um, but the story itself, I do understand that it's not particularly fascinating. It's about, uh, yes, it's in the United States and you get a family of workers and uh, one of the sons who got away to study in New York City actually comes back because he has quite a strong strong and angry feelings toward his brother so he comes back because he wants to get better to have his revenge and to be done with it to stop having negativities in, mind, in his mind but the writing style is incredible it's beyond anything you I've probably ever read. It's really wonderful. You have to get used to it, to be honest. It probably took me, I don't know, 100 pages. But this one is actually 900 pages. So, you know, I haven't finished yet. But I already know that this will be one of my favorite books of all time. And look at that. First cover, which is so pretty. And look at the second cover, which is so pretty as well. I don't know. I'm in love. In terms of music, my favorite one is actually not a discovery, but it's an artist that I used to know. Well, I still do know, but I used to really listen to when I was younger, and I grew tired of it for some reason. And I actually listened to him again this week, and it's been it's been a wonderful week. Uh, his name is Jimmy Neko. He played in a band called Hours. And he's just an incredible performer, he has a unique voice. So I don't know, maybe listen to I Heard You Singing, which is a favorite of mine, or Crying, or I don't know, there are a lot of his songs and his covers that are just beyond anything. I really love them. Actually, so I'm going to go with Star Wars The Force Awakens, which is already a good movie. I, think I have a soft spot for probably every member of the cast. Um, I love Daisy Ridley, I love John Boyga, I love Oscar Isaac, I love Adam Driver, I love Harrison Ford, I love Carrie Fisher, I love Lupita Nyongo, I love everyone I just love everyone in this movie so yeah it's good but uh, it's a good action movie but it didn't change my whole uh, life so I'm a bit disappointed in myself in terms of movies this month and for the last category I actually have two things so the first one is starting my bullet journal uh, I just you know new year new me uh, I started a bullet journal and it's actually a really really good thing and the last favorite of mine is actually a bit weird, probably, but uh, I watched the European Championship of Ice Dance um, of this year, and I fell in love with the French program. Uh, so I'm just, I don't know, I'm just going to put a link to the video because it's just so beautiful. It's really well done. I think they got the first place for that, so it's not just some, you know, patriotic. I'm French, so I'm loving the French ones. They were really, really beautiful. Uh, and they did the choreography 
on To Build a Home by the Cinematic Orchestra. And it's one of my favorite songs of all time as well, so I really got my heart pumped for them. So yeah, I hope you liked my favorites. Please feel free to share yours with me, uh, because I would love to first watch a lot of better movies than I've done this month. And yeah, please. Bye.